Hey guys, this is Hatred from AffiliateHustle.com. In this video, we're going to go over my YouTube ranking method. Um, so this method works. It's worked for me. I showed Franklin it. It works for him. Um, this is just an example from my notebooks and stuff I write down. Um, I have just a couple parts that I do. Um, so the third part being um, optimizing videos, and the fourth part being my offsite work, so backlinks and social stuff simulating a viral effect. Um, I'll go over these in more detail in the video portion of the tutorial. These are just screenshots to demonstrate what I do and how I write stuff down. Um, so video optimization. Just a lot of on-site stuff, so the shit in your description and before uploading the video. Um, this sometimes, even just this on-site stuff and just basic like extra juice I have written down in here. Um, the way I save the video and certain stuff I do to it sometimes is enough, but um, off-site stuff, viral effect, I write questionably works because it sometimes just depends on um, Google itself. Like you'll see certain videos that just never hit the front page, no matter what you do, and sometimes that just means YouTube is filtering or Google is filtering them out on YouTube. Um. I want to note that I don't boost views, I don't boost likes or comments, and I don't use any sort of third party services. It's completely against their TOS and it's blatantly obvious when you boost a video, it just looks like fucking shit. So I don't do it. Um, Alright, so let's dive right into it. Alright, for this I downloaded a random video, I searched like um, Rhinoplasty Plano, Texas, just the typical Alex Becker example. Um, so the video I downloaded just with um, derpy.com, stole the video, I don't really promote that, but um, you can do that, it doesn't matter. So this is just some on-site stuff that I talked about in this tutorial. Um, Alright, so optimizing the video. Say our keyword was, in fact, rhinoplasty, um, Plano, Texas. And then say I did TX or just to hit the the um, TX portion of Texas. Now that's our that's our main keyword. Now this is the um, extra juice portion. Um, notice how this is already an MP4, so I don't have to worry about that. Normally, if you render in something like Sony Vegas, you're gonna want to like render it as an MP4. Um, you're gonna hit properties. You're gonna go over to details. And I do this on all my videos. I don't know if it necessarily works, but I've noticed that this does help in ranking. Um, I five star the video. Um, tags, I'll add in the tags that I normally would do on YouTube itself. So Rhino Plasty Plano Texas. Um, that's our main keyword. Um, title, so this is the title of the video Rhino Plasty Plano Texas. And then, say we do rhinoplasty surgery. I like to do the title as the main keyword and the subtitle as like um, secondary. So rhinoplasty surgery in Plano, Texas. Um, then you're gonna hit apply so that those settings get saved. And then hit okay. And that's just the extra juice portion. And then we're gonna go over to um, YouTube. Hey, shout outs to you guys online. Tom Jones, Michael Rayburn, and Intense. Thanks for being active. Um, so we're going to go Documents, Render, and then open that video. And now it's uploading. Now I'm not going to, I'm probably going to remove this just in case of any like copyright strikes or anything like that, but um, Rhinoplasty Plant, or Rhinoplasty. Plano, Texas. I believe that's what we did for the name, right? Yep. And then in the description, if you guys notice, um, my descriptions are pretty long. I I remember someone commenting on somewhere on our forum that content isn't king. I can I find that bullshit with YouTube videos because I find that what I do is I'll find a video and say I see like, for example, this rhinoplasty video I stole. Um, 
um, Plano, Texas, has little to no content in the, the description. So what I think in my mind is like, if he has no content, what if I wrote like 300 words and like optimize the, the content itself for keywords, I should rank better, correct? Like that's the way it works. Like Google owns YouTube. They probably have some sort of algorithm that determines that. So in here, I like to do 300 to 500 words um of just straight content or i'll trick it trickle in like um keywords and stuff um actually you know what i'll do i'll probably pause this write up some like short description and uh um so for example final plasty plano texas surgery is a great option when trying to correct your physical appearance. People say that first don't not to judge. Physical. We in fact are judging every part. I don't know. Like that's probably real bad grammar. I don't really know. I'm not really caring. Um, just something like that. So here I have um keyword and tags. Yeah, I don't like to overly um, excessively add those in. Keyword and description, just remember to keep the density at about 1% or so. Um, they'll figure out what you're trying to rank for. Keyword in the title, um, these are already in there, that's right. Um, interlinked videos, that's another great idea. That, I, that seems to help a ton. And if I wrote down here, if you're in a local um, setting trying to target something like this, so say I'm in Texas, I would add the local to Texas because I'm targeting Texas um, keywords at the bottom. All right, so what I like to do is to write like extra useful stuff and then I'll write the keywords right here. So rhinoplasty surgery, Plano, Texas. And that seems to seems to help again. I'll do it in the disc or the tags here. And I don't know, just thumbnail I don't really think matters. Now advanced settings. I always like to do the recording date as today. Um search location. Again, so we're targeting Texas. We wanna We want to set the locale to that. Comments. With these types of videos, typically you don't want comments. Um, I'll just leave them on for now, but um, everything else is fine. And then hit publish. Now, I don't know if this ranked. I doubt it did. Um, the keyword is probably pretty popular. I just spelled rhinoplasty wrong. I just saw that. Um, rhinoplasty. Save changes. Um, the keyword's pretty competitive considering Becker um, advertises it. Yeah, so that video is still ranking. It might take like the offsite stuff in order to move it, but. Um, that was just an example of how to set it up. I didn't really expect to rank right off the bat. But for something that nobody targets, that's typically what I'll do. I'll find like keywords nobody has a YouTube video for, um, and just try to rank it on YouTube based on those types of things. So something like GSA settings 2015, I optimize this one similarly. So yeah, I have a decent amount of content. You see what I mean? Like a lot of people just write, like to write like little content, um, some useful terms, keywords I was targeting. Um, GSA settings is in there throughout the video. 
Um, I believe G S A S T R. Yeah, so that's pretty much how I rank um, those keywords. Oh well, yeah, it may actually rank, but I'm going to remove the upload because I just don't want copyright strikes on our YouTube. That'd be a shame for uh, all that work to be gone. Um, but yeah, thanks again for watching these videos. Um, there should be another one next week. I have plans for a bunch of tutorials. I have around like eight more in a text document to do. So um, yeah, just stay tuned and thanks for watching. This has been Hatred from AffiliateHustle.com.